inside the heart of Dupax del Sur, province of Nueva Vizcaya, in its Barangay Belance, is where you will find this year's nominee for the most outstanding Barangay Food Terminal and Geo Manage, the St. Joseph Barangay Food Terminal. Farming is the major source of livelihood in this barangay, which accounted for 60% of the total population. The place is about 37 kilometers away from the nearest market or trading post, which entails high cost of transportation for the residents. The situation prompted the St. Joseph Parish Multipurpose Cooperative to look for strategies that will ease the Belancy residents and its neighboring barangays from high cost of living owing to the distance of said communities to the nearest trading and business centers. Thus, on January 25, 2010 to be exact, the said cooperative signified their intent to the Department of Agriculture by requesting one unit barangay food terminal project which was approved. With an initial funding assistance of 166,000, 315 and 50 centavos from the Department of Agriculture, the project was launched on December 28, 2010. Of the said amount, 86,960 pesos was used for the procurement of goods for sale while the remaining amount was allocated for the procurement of BFT equipment, facilities, and for other related expenses. Source of agricultural products and supply for sale will come from the farmers of said barangay. There were 35 regular suppliers of assorted vegetables, 7 assorted fruits, and 10 meat products. Supplies of vegetables and other wage goods were replenished once or twice a week. Likewise, about 2-3 to three heads of pigs were butchered weekly. With the launching of said project, residents were benefited and the basic goods are now available at affordable price. Not worry, when typhoons Pedring and Kiel hit Region 2 were in roads and bridges connecting the highland to lowland areas of Nueva Vizcaya were washed out, the BFT had served its purpose as food depot. The project was able to provide stable and affordable food products in the area, thus panic buying was avoided. To minimize foliage of vegetables, the management practiced value-adding by converting this into a viand for theirs and workers' consumption. Vegetable trimmings were also provided free to hog racers in the said barangay. The SJMPC BFT had been a great help to the community. It opens up its doors as a market to backyard vegetable growers and hog racers. Residents in the area are now enjoying the availability of safe goods, which is lower from the existing nearby markets and Talipapa at any given time. The project also generates employment. The cooperative was able to hire one sales clerk, a purchaser, and a helper as a regular employee. These employees also enjoy benefits such as SSS and PhilHealth insurance in addition to their monthly salary. The SJPMP BFT started its operation with an initial capital of 86,960 pesos only. After one year of operation, the BFT has 252,518.58 cash in bank and 70,229.95 goods available for sale as of December 2011. To date, SJP MPC is adopting a computerized point of sale which provides an updated recording on the daily transaction of the BFT. Members also enjoy their patronage refund of which 20% of its net income were distributed to the members. 10% will be set aside as community development fund. To provide better service to its patrons and members, a slaughterhouse at the back of the BFT building is now under construction. Likewise, three satellite stores will soon be established to provide wage goods needed in the area and serve as an alternative market outlet for backyard vegetable growers. The cooperative would like also to venture in vegetable processing to minimize losses which will serve as another source of income. They also procured one unit tricycle which will be used in hauling and transporting wage goods to their future satellite stores. 
with all the worthwhile projects mentioned above, the St. Joseph Parish Multipurpose Cooperative deserves to be nominated as the most outstanding barangay food terminal and geomanage of Region 2.